Yo, what's good everybody? So today we got Brandon Urie's best live vocals. He is, look, he's one of my favorite singers out there today. It's very unique for a male singer today to have like the crooner voice that Brandon Yuri has been going for and more of a full sounding timbre that is really able to get up into the stratosphere. A lot of pop singers today are going from the more nasal sort of vibe, which is cool. I'm into that, but Brandon Yuri is special. By the way, I am a vocal coach. If you want to check me out, my website is youcansinganything.com. I teach online lessons through Skype every single day. I also offer a reward on my Patreon down in the description where I will review your singing in a video very similar to this one and help you improve your voice. And quick interruption, I am so sorry. Be sure that you subscribe to our, our vlogging channel. That's right, vlogging channel, link in the description. All that being said, okay, here we go. Brandon Yuri's best live vocals. I'm excited for this one. Let's go, let's go. I'm, I'm about to get hyped for this. That growl though. I love how he goes that for that really fuller voice. Okay, wait, let me before, before we continue, I'm gonna beat you guys to the comments. I'm gonna get some. Uh, you're gonna y'all be gonna be saying right now, this guy looks like Brandon Yuri, an off-brand Brandon Yuri, a Walmart Brandon Yuri. I'm gonna just beat you to that shit, all right? Because I don't want to hear it. <laughs> No, if somebody said that you look like somebody beat the shit out of Brandon Yuri, just don't even start today. Just let's focus on his voice, all right? <laughs> he really opens his mouth while he sings. Oh my god, the energy that he's putting into this performance is pretty amazing, actually. Yes! His upper range is so good. He goes up there without getting too... Too full. This is my favorite way to hear him, by the way. Acoustic. Not a choice, I'm just a villain vying for attention from a girl. Girl, you can't decide. Here's the reason why girls are Woo! Girls that falsetto though. He does this so effortlessly. Girls love girls and boys. The range that he was just singing in. Okay, another thing I really appreciate about him is that when he sings live, almost every single time I've heard him on like videos where he sings live, it's live. Like, <laughs> Ooh! his mix is so good. Okay. Okay. What the fuck? Can, I, can we also just... Can we appreciate the range of genres that he can sing for a second here? Oh my god, his range is just so easy for him. Part of it, by the way, is because he is choosing a darker sound to his voice that he's able to go up higher. It's a, it's a big benefit of, of, of choosing that sound timbre. Oh! 
he, his pitch is so good too. I don't know if I've heard a, a flat note yet. Let me point something out here, because this is a really, really cool. So as you go up in pitch, I often describe it as going towards nasality, but you can also describe it in terms of vowels. So you can hear it in this perfect s scale here. Uh, 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 uh. Going from like an O or an uh to an A. Uh, or uh, take a listen. You you can really appreciate what he's doing here and how masterful it is. And you don't really get the sense that he's changing vowels unless you're listening for it. That beautiful transition. I'm gonna hear that again. Oh my god. <laughs> I forgot how much I love him. Yo, he is next level on this song. Whoa! I don't know what that. Oh my god! I sorry to just keep stopping it. I don't know where he was performing there, by the way, but I think it's amazing that no matter what show he's doing, it looked like a fairly small venue based on how close he was to them. And it sounded like his acoustic guitar wasn't mic'd. I don't know if that's true or not, but he's giving it 100% in every performance. Whether he's on a big stage or a small stage. Oh no! Are these, is he gonna? Is he in the, is he, is he, is he gonna go up there? Oh my, this performance I love, the sign in the afternoon performance. It's one of my favorites. <laughs> Sorry, I'm fanboying a lot right now. It could be, and we know that it should. Oh! And you know that you feel it too. Cause it's not in the afternoon. Your eyes are the size of the moon. You could cause you can see you too. Oh! I am just getting... I haven't, so I haven't appreciated his vocals enough recently <laughs> in my life. And by, by that, I mean, I just haven't listened, you know, I haven't listened to him lately. And I'm starting to remember why I liked him so much. Just the way that we do when it's not in the afternoon. Your eyes are the size of the moon. You're good because you can, so you do. And we're feeling so good. It's one, three, nine. He's playing at the same time. Do you know what I mean? Back to the place where we used to say, Man, it feels good to feel that Ah! I wish more pop singers would do what he's doing. And have his level of proficiency. This is my favorite, favorite cover from him. I guess acoustic cover? I don't know how to describe it. This is my favorite. This is my favorite, 100%.
The way he gets to those high notes, uh, just one more time. I, I've listened to this version so many times. How? Again? Yes! This song is so good, and now he's... Uh, I used to know my roommates so much trying to do that. <laughs> so much. Those upper notes, though. Walking the long road, watching the sky fall. So, uh, lo long road, watching the sky fall. The lace in your dress, dress. my neck. How do I live the death of a bachelor? So much control. So by the way, his approach to those notes in this clip compared to the last one are different. I don't know if you noticed that. In this one, he's it's more of a closed sound. The last one was more of an open belt sound. And it's because he knows how to use his voice and adjust it appropriately to the environment that he's in or the how loud he needs to be. Like, it's amazing. I love this clip too. You know, someone once used this clip in an online debate. Like, I, I used to post on singing forums, like, and I regret doing that on Reddit of all places, where people would talk about singing technique. And someone once used this clip to argue that Brendan Yuri is not that good. I was like, what the? F what is wrong with you? Some people just don't. They have no ear. It's perfect. He, just how he's able to adjust his voice in so many different ways. Oh, he's able to sing light, he can sing heavy. He can sing however the fuck he wants. So good. The more heavy approach here. He's working so hard for this, but in a good way. By the way, can I point out as well how amazing it is that he's managed to stay relevant for so long? I remember this song back from middle school. Closing 
Thanks, amazing that belt was amazing oh my god okay thank you so much for recommending me check out this video everybody be sure you like this video if you like this video drop a comment down below let me know what you think about brendan yuri's vocals and be sure that you subscribe if you're new be sure that you check out my website you can sing anything.com i am a voice teacher i teach be sure you check me out be sure you check me out <laughs> fuck <gasps> Bye, everybody. Be sure you check out my website, youcansinganything.com. Peace out, everybody.